my friend Moira put this post on their Instagram story and it was like a screenshot of a Tumblr post and somebody was asking where's that one quote about how the weight of the world feels like nothing when you're with your friends and then underneath it was the quote I clicked on the post I saved it and then I didn't read a single word of it I already knew in advance that whatever that quote said was going to destroy me and sure enough a couple days passed I opened my saved posts I read the full quote And then for the next week, life felt like this. I moved to Milwaukee in July of 2022, basically to go to school here and get my film degree. It's been over two years and I have so many friends. I have film friends, I have co-workers that are so lovely that are all like amazing to be around and I love every second that we talk but I still haven't really found a friend group. Over the summer I got to visit and stay in my hometown for a little over two weeks and I got to do an original musical which was like the greatest and biggest production of anything I've ever done in my life. It was basically just me and all of my most beloved friends from my hometown working extremely hard every single day for two weeks straight. We did two full days of the show and when it was finally done and when it was time to leave the next day after our last performance, I felt this horrible, horrible weight. I knew that I needed to go home here to Milwaukee and to return to my responsibilities, but Jesus Christ, everything in my being was begging me not to leave. I basically had a friggin' meltdown. Like, I was crying for the whole car ride back. I guess I'm sort of at a stage in my life where I'm trying to figure out my brain little by little, and I continuously search for the one answer that's gonna fix everything, and I know that that isn't really <laughs> a thing that happens. I know that that isn't true, but <laughs> the reason that I wanted to make this video is because I'm grappling with how much of the nonsense in here would be solved or at least subdued if I had a friend group that I could continuously see. The first film that I ever made here in Milwaukee talked about um, inescapable loneliness. loneliness. I think it's frightening me a little bit how little has changed since I made that. I don't really know what the point of this video is except for maybe to vent, but I know that I have the most precious friends ever back in my hometown. And I try to talk to them as much as I can, but it's just not the same, is it? And I don't know how to make new friends in my 20s. This silence. I don't know how to do it. Even my bones feel lonely. Although I saw this TikTok a while ago that kind of changed my life. I've been feeling a little depressed because I haven't hung out with any friends lately, but then I was like, wait, I could just set that shit up myself. You said you're down? All right. I'm gonna work on it, I guess. I'm gonna work on inviting people over. What doesn't help with any of this is that I have social anxiety. So even like the smallest of conversations with people that I absolutely adore so scares the shit so out of me. Weird. So God, why are you so awkward? How how 
do I just bring people over here? I don't know. I'm gonna try though, I guess, because this is killing me. It's killing me. It's killing me. I'm gonna try. I guess that's the takeaway. Okay. Goodbye.